Hey everyone, welcome back. Another video, another top Epons video of 2021. Today, we're looking at Uchimata, and a beautiful one by Murao here, the extra power from Germany. Wonderful, wonderful Uchimata. Both kind of looking for the inside leg, but Murao, he kind of waits and counters. He anticipates the movement, gets in there, and he's got the grips. Brilliant Uchimata by Murao. Next up, picking someone up from the Newaza. Why not? Drops down, hand on the belt, here we go. It's a great strength from Nozari from Georgia. Gets a brilliant Uchimata. And look at this, beautiful work against Muki, world champion here. So Chuchi, just look at all the fakes. Little twitch with the foot, little fake with the hip. Jumps in there. Lovely, lovely Uchimata. Right, I love this one. It's probably one of my top in this entire video. Come on, look at that. After such a, a long Ochigari like that, and then to just change direction and jump in straight like that. Come on, such agility. And the Uzbekistan team, quite a few of them are doing Uchimata. A couple from uh, Bobanov as well. But here we have Nozadzi. And he's got quite a few Epons in my uh, last couple of videos. He can do it all, really. But seriously, such lift, such power. That's a really, really nice Uchimata. Next up, we've got a Harai Goshi. There's only a couple in this video. And I thought, why not? We'll just put Harai Goshi and Uchimata together. Hopefully no one complains. But this one here, beautiful work, turning the corner. Generating that movement to just get him on his back. Boom, goes over. Didn't take much. Right, next one's kind of interesting. Kind of like an Ashiguruma. But uh, his foot's on the inside, so we're going to classify it as an Uchimata. But really nice Bayatsu from Russia. And I like that underhand grip he's got. Kind of an interesting way to go about it. Usually Uchimata, you see people taking top grips, but it is a good technique to do with the under grip as well. And to be honest, I think most Japanese people prefer the under grip. That's just my uh, personal opinion, but uh, either or, do what works for you. And look at this. So White, even though he's holding on to his, that sleeve, it's not really doing anything. High elbow, kind of defending the, the sleeve grab there. Raigoshi Makikomi now. Good if you're a taller fighter. You can kind of wrap your body around them, and of course you're longer. Gotta watch out for those pickups though, you don't want to be counted. And here's another one guys. Beautiful Raigoshi Makikomi. Kind of low on the wrist, but gets the job done. Yatsev again now. Kind of an interesting Uchimata, takes a couple of stabs at it. Goes in, hooks the leg and then just kinking Uchimata it. Gets the lift, gets the throw. Not very pretty if I do say so myself. This on the other hand, that's what I want to see. That's a beautiful one. Top grip. It's got the sleeve. Inside grip on the sleeve, really interesting. Here's another one. Love the lift. And the good thing about this one, just look at the balance, the strength. You know, he just holds that leg there for a little bit longer. Gets him over. And this one's beautiful too. Goes in behind for the Tani Otoshi, but gets countered with an Uchimata. And this is why Personally, I like to do the Uchimata with an inside grip. It's good defensively as well as offensively. Woo! Not many Korean judoka doing uh, Uchimata, but Kim, he's got a really good one. Top grip, even though he's a shorter judoka, but still manages to get in there. Now Bobanov, his Uchimata, kind of interesting. He, he's It's not a Makikomi, but the way he bends his arm like that, it kind of acts like a, a makikomi. And the way he jumps his hip in there, it's, it's almost like a koshiwaza. And then he's just using the leg as a guide, kind of an extra point of attack. So really, really interesting. Uh, Uchimata by Bobanov, kind of a, a mix between a koshiwaza and a Uchimata. Now I love this one, such a strength in the position, being really strong. White goes in for a bear hug attack, a kosotogake, but blue just stays really, really strong in the position. 
Look at that, another Uzbekistan fighter. What's with the Uzbekistani fighters doing Uchimata? It's crazy. Most of them do it. Look at this one. Beautiful work. This time a grip from the tricep, moving it over the top. Little Osoto attack. Kochi as well. Steps in. Secures the deal. So many fakes, so many setups, combinations. Another big one here, and another Uzbekistan fighter. Come on. These guys are Uchimata legends. Wrapping them up well there. Pulling on the sleeve. So important for Uchimata. Left us right now. And blue. Huge mistake. Taking that top grip against the taller fighter. Not recommended because he's going to break it off when he goes in for the, for the technique. Right next up, this one. Really, really nicely done. Kind of reminds me a little bit of Maruyama. Maybe uh, he kind of watched the fights of Maruyama against Yongdong Perenlai and thought this is how to do it. Gets the grip and then just the footwork. Beautiful lift. Drives him over. And here we have one of the new additions to the Japanese team. And you gotta love these blended techniques. He's kind of mixing in an Ogoshi with an Uchimata. Starts the movement off with a pickup. Gets his hand around the back, goes to pick him up, but then adjusts. Uses the leg. Why not? Why not stick the leg out there? And here's another one. A bit more traditional. Some might call it a, a Hanegoshi. But that's gotta be one of the best Epons of the year. Taller fighter. Gets in there with all his his length that he can. Perfect in every respect. A little bit of Ashibaza now. Takabatake from Brazil. And he has a really fast, lightning fast, one step Uchimata. Look at him jump in here. One step. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. Right, just a couple more Epons now, guys. So uh, let me know in the timestamps which ones you like the best and uh, there's going to be a, a video later on the top ponds of 2021 I'll make a short selection I'm thinking about 20 20 from uh, all these videos that I've been doing recently so make sure you check those out as well uh, also the Gadi highlights from 2021 Ashiwaza hip throws uh, Newaza is coming tomorrow and I think that is it oh and the sacrifice throws don't forget that one as well Big Harai Goshi. That might have to be there. That might be one of the best. Alright guys, so like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!